This is Eight Minutes of Awesome. I'm Jennifer Lipsky. Speaking with me today is Matthew Dalitz, the founder and editor-in-chief of The Neuropsychotherapist. The Neuropsychotherapist is an online magazine and resource for therapists and clinicians to keep them informed and updated with the latest in neuroscience, as well as associated research to enhance their practice. Hi, Matthew. Hi, Jennifer. You know, Matthew, I noticed that you are in Brisbane, uh, which is Queensland, Australia, but I was looking at the neuropsychotherapist, and it looks like you have an impressive board of advisors that are globally based. Yes, we're, we're very global. Yeah, that's really excellent. Really, really good. And, you know, um, also in looking at your website, I was really intrigued by your tagline because I think it's a really powerful statement. And mm. what it says is changing minds, changing lives. So I would like to know how you came to develop that phrase. Yeah, well, um, from uh, there's, I guess there's two sort of levels to this. I mean, changing minds, changing lives is what we do as therapists, as uh, in, in psychotherapy and in counseling. And also um, in particular for the magazine and the platform that we have, um, it's about um, changing minds on a neural level. So actually physically changing minds and thus changing lives. Mm, yeah, that's really profound. And, and I'm sure that um, with the reach, your global reach of the neuropsychotherapist, you really are doing just that. So my question is, why do you do what you do? How did you come to, to be a founder of such a, a valuable resource? Uh, well, um, it's a it's an interesting synergy of my love for um, artistic things um, and the publishing side. Um, I'm very interested in in the artistic uh, aspect of doing the layout and all, all of the aspects of publishing. And then there's the other part of my life, which is as as a therapist and my interest in neurobiology. And so fusing the two of those together, it just seemed to be a natural fit to be publishing this sort of material. Wow, that, that's yeah. amazing. Um, what was your background in, in that brought you to this journey? You, you professionally um, worked in? Uh, yeah, well, I, I started off um, doing um, a degree in psychology at the University of Queensland. And uh, I then got carried away in, um, on the arts side. I, I went to the Conservatorium of Music and did um, a whole lot of stuff there with composition and uh, that satisfied the artistic side of me. Um, but it wasn't paying the bill, so I, I then also uh, got a job um, as a paramedic and I studied um, um, the, the science behind you know, paramedic studies and did 10 years as a paramedic. And then I did another 10 years in business, um, which involved, a, a, you know, a, a whole different world. And now I'm sort of synergizing all of those things together as I'm coming back to psychology. Um, I'm doing a master's in counseling. And, um, and I think that the, the synergy of my my business, um, my arts, and uh, my psychology is all coming together in these publications that we're doing with the neuropsychotherapist. Yeah, that's really exciting. And it's interesting you um, hit on the creativity component because creativity mm. is so, it's such a profound vehicle for healing, for expression, so important. It is, it is. And I am very fascinated by the the whole um, aspect of, of intuition in therapy as well, um, which is one of those slippery things you can't quite grasp with it, but it's so very important in therapy. Yes, I absolutely agree with you, for sure. And I'm interested to know who has inspired you on this path? Um, yeah, well, uh, um, I have uh, a friend here in Australia at the University of Queensland, Dr. Peter Rousseau, and he has done um, extensive study in, in areas of neuropsychotherapy. And um, I guess he's my sort of main mentor, um, and, uh, and he and I have been working on a number of things together, and he's been um, just a great inspiration um, to me. And um, I guess one of uh, his influences that has become one of my influences is um, the late Dr. Klaus Grave, 
from Switzerland um, who about a decade ago wrote a book called Neuropsychotherapy, um, how the science of neuro, how neuroscience is informing psychotherapy. And uh, some of his groundwork has been very inspirational. And then other people that have been influencing me have been Alan Shaw and Dan Siegel and the whole um, team of uh, interpersonal neurobiology people. Um, Louis Cozzolino, um, Bonnie Benanock, and um, uh, oh, just too many to name. And yeah. uh, they've been very influential, and and I just love that whole interpersonal neurobiology approach, and um, and that's very much where we're tracking with the neuropsychotherapist. Wow, that's really wonderful. You know, um, it, those are it's it's a lot of names, a lot of people, but you know, to draw on all of that research and to really weave it together in this strong tapestry mm -hmm. um, really gives a lot of great information, and people can by using the neuropsychotherapist and, and drawing um, from all of that information, they can take what they need um, best for their practice, their own practice, and use uh, it. Yes, exactly. What, what, we, uh, what we're providing, I believe, is, is like a meta framework, um, a, a perspective which takes into account um, lots of dis different disciplines um, that can be assimilated into the therapist's, you know, main mode of, of work. Um, so we're, it's not like that we're a new um, therapeutic technique. No, we're, we're, we're wanting to just bring together the latest science to inform therapists um, and just improve what they're already doing. Yeah, that's extremely yeah. valuable. And I'm sure that there is a message um, in all the work that you've done um, in your life personally and professionally, I'm sure that there is a message that you would like others to hear. Would you share that? Uh, well, um, that was just so wonderfully complex, um, you know, on a physical, mental, um, social, spiritual level. And, and because I'm speaking to, to therapists mainly, um, I, I guess my message to, to, to therapist is to embrace um, this multidisciplinary smorgasbord that we have available to us and um, and to really um, get in and absorb a lot of the the latest science uh, so that we can be more effective on a bio psycho social spiritual level mm. yeah that's really good you know for anyone who would like to learn more you can read more at the neuropsychotherapist.com. Right. Uh, Matthew Dallas, thank you so much for joining me today on 8 Minutes of Awesome. Thank you, Jennifer.